they make up reality in their heads. Like human beings who are just innocent, doing their own business, just going about their lives. If they're convenient for these people to murder, uh, they'll make up anything about them. They'll make up a reality that they're heroes and this person's bad. You know, y'all know, kind of know the score on that. Um, but I guess I just wanted to make a video. They're making it really hard for me because my chest feels like it's about to cave in. Give me a second to catch my breath. I'm hoping maybe y'all can see, because uh, you can see some of the videos in my house, and I really had it defended good. And I hope you you just look at me now. Um, you know, it's I'm not that bad, uh, but the way they're hitting me in the head, it, it seems very very dangerous. It does seem like, yeah, you know, I don't I don't think I have brain damage that I can't get out of, but it does seem like it's it's really hurting and damaging my head because they they hit me all night and I don't really have much defending it. My plates aren't taking the remote uh, stuff out as good as being right by his stuff. Uh, you know, I'm working on my defenses. I'm, I'm getting more plugs and I'm going to get like a hat to block it and working on some more personal defender stuff. But, um, you know, I just wanted to make this video. Um, I hope, I hope all of you are doing good. Um, God really is behind us on this. Good is behind us. We are right. Like, we are right in this, like, but the thing is that a lot of people in this country, in this world, now, uh, I guess because they're insane or spiritual evil that I don't understand, they think that power is right, that because they have terrorism and they have, you know, uh, anonymity, uh, that we are evil no matter what, even if we haven't done anything, and they are good because they can do whatever they want, uh, which is insane. It's insanity. If that, if it progresses and it keeps growing and people just like our, the children coming up, like learn this kind of mentality, it will destroy our future. People won't even want to live. They'll just be living to kind of go along with life. There, there'll be no meaning. There'll be no art. There'll be nothing that that brings us forward that we can be happy about. People will just be living and they'll just be kind of soulless husks kind of going along with the system. Uh, so for me, I mean, and for all of y'all, because we are being tortured and raped, there is no choice. Um, but we've got to let other people know because for regular people who are maybe involved in this in a, in a um, smaller way, who don't know what's going on, or, um, you know, people who aren't involved in it at all, this is detrimental to their lives and their future. It's so important that we fight this for them, and they need to know, they have to know. It's not something, it's not this option of like, oh, well, you know, don't want to scare anybody. These people have to know eventually. And I know there are some people that are they're just like, you know, shut up about it, don't believe you, no, that's fine, you know, see them later or whatever, or hang out with them. But the people who will listen, we got to start grabbing them telling them what's going on because it's their future too. Uh, this can come to them. And I mean, these are all things that have been talked about before. Uh, but I guess, I guess I just wanted to make a video, kind of show y'all how I'm doing because I'm not doing that great. I wake up every morning and I had a certain period of time where it's like I looked in the mirror and I was like, I got to go to the hospital because they're just hitting me in the head and the neck so much. It's, it's hurting me so, so physically that I was like, I need to go seek medical attention. But I didn't, because I've tried to seek medical attention before, and they just call me crazy. So kind of all y'all know about that. Um, you know, a doctor probably wouldn't even prescribe me painkillers uh, for this. They would mark it as, uh, you know, a mental illness and try and, like, lock me away, or they would try and give me some kind of mental medication so they wouldn't even treat my pain. And then I'll have an EMS or a couple of EMS workers a day uh, caravan me, drive by me, uh, kind of like, ha, 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 we're murdering you illegally and you can't do shit about it. Um, and that's fun. Uh, but this is, this is definitely, it, it does exist. So, I mean, I'm, I'm preaching to the choir for target individuals. Uh, be very careful. Like, like if you want to, if you want to talk to me, Please uh, comment, say I need to talk to you, or email me at vulcanwolverine at gmail.com. 
I, I wouldn't suggest leaving your number on those comments. Um, and I know some, you know, some people have done it. You know, they're like, I'm not, you know, I'm not afraid. And I respect that. But the deal is uh, that these people are cowards. So if they see a number in the comments, like a phone number in the comments, they'll go ahead and they'll call that. They'll call that and they'll be like, oh, you know, hey. But if they have to come through an email and talk to me by an email and then I talk to them and I pass, they're not going to do that. They're not going to go to that much trouble. So that's why I kind of I kind of say don't put the numbers in the comments. Um, but but it, it's fine, you know, uh, we'll... we'll kind of get through that anyway uh perpetrators are going to kind of come in no matter what but um you know we've got to we've got to do a couple of levels to protect each other to to vet each other and make sure that we're not perpetrators but also you know not be scared to reach out to each other um the 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 biggest thing is kind of just doing a couple of little layers like you know email me let's talk then give the numbers and the information because they won't go they're they're too cowardly you know they're they're lazy pretty much if they can sit and push a button to murder somebody they will but they're not going to help their people you know they're not going to help they're not going to do a lot of work um you know to 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 just call somebody and mess with them or something like that um all right i'm pretty agitated today y'all can tell um i'm going to definitely end this one in a prayer I need God right now, and me and my roommate do devotionals, um, and we're, you know, we're good friends, and you know, I'm not, whenever I talk about her not believing me, it's tough because I've got to defend myself, like, because it's physically hurting me, but, um, but she's like, you know, you've got to get over that, and we've all heard that, where you've got to get over that, people, you know, they kind of compare it to to things that they go through in their life that they've gotten over that are in their past. But as we understand, it's always going on. They're really, it's, oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, they're really, it's just hitting me in the chest so bad. So much pressure and my heart's palpitating. See, when I had the, it was awesome at my house because I had the plates right next to their weapons and so it hit me in the chest, but then it would buffer out. But now I'm in a in a situation where they'll hit me in a point in my body, and it just keeps coming. So I've, I've had that before, before I got all my defenses up at the house. And it's made me kind of respect everybody who doesn't have that situation, like, a whole lot more. Um, you know, I kind of forgot how good I had it for a while. But now I don't, and I've still got to keep going. Um... And I've got to figure it out, something that will, you know, buffer it out, that will stop it. Um, but these people, they see any, even if it's like, even if it's underhanded, which obviously hiding in the shadows and remotely killing somebody is underhanded, but they'll go even more underhanded than that. You know, they'll turn people against you or hit people around you, your family, your pets. Um, you know, Pepper uh, is, is being hit, like I can tell she's sick. Her hearing is gone. Uh, she can't hear when I call her. Pepper. 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 So if y'all see that, you, I, I call her and her hearing's gone. Like her head's been damaged and her hearing's been damaged because her hearing's more sensitive than mine. She sleeps right next to me, uh, so her hearing is gone from this stuff. You know, people are saying she's just getting old. You know, they'll use every excuse in the book, just like you know, they'll, they'll use every excuse in the book to why we're going through what we're going through. Um, it, because there's no target to hit. There's nothing for people to be like, that. this is going on. People don't understand it. And that's why before we even start fighting these people, which we have to do, it's it's... We, there is no choice. They're not doing good. They're against this country. They're against this world. They're against humans uh, for some reason. Um, you know, they've seen this technology, which is so magical to them and novel, that they've given their lives away to, to murder and rape and whatever. Um, so, so there is no choice for us. And I know, you know, all y'all feel the same way. Uh, we have to fight them. But... Before we can, uh, we have to paint a target on them. 
And that's why, like, I'm going to do, you know, this, this YouTube channel. I'm going to keep going on it, getting everybody who's making videos. I'll, I'll collect you on my channel. I'll subscribe to you. Then I'm going to do a blog, and I'm going to connect it to, you know, my Facebook page and connect the YouTube channel to a Facebook page, a new Facebook page. We've got to get as much, as many media outlets as we can, uh, you know, reporting this because we are reporting it. There are no reporters that are that are going out and searching for this story. Um, you know, we've got to we've got to contact them, but we also have to be the reporters. So anybody who has any, like I know there's some people who can't make videos for work, um, you know, for whatever. But the people who can, if you think that it's a talent of yours to speak, to make videos, even creative videos where you don't have to show your face, um, the time is now because this program is going to go down. It's just when. And, you know, I've talked about that a lot. It is, it's a win thing, not an if. And the faster that we put out information and report this, because we are reporting it. We are the reporters. Uh, the, the target individuals who speak out, we are the reporters. Um, because the mainstream media isn't reporting something that is right in all of our faces, you know, everybody knows about. And for some reason, they're only showing it on local news. Mainstream media will not report it. And, you know, mainstream media is totally controlled. So we are the reporters in this, and it's a fight that we have to fight. I know I'm telling you all stuff that you already know. Um, I guess I'm just kind of getting it out of my system because it's been a rough, rough week. Uh, I failed completely because they're remote neural monitoring my emotions and then hurting me really badly to get reactions and false flag me. Um, and it's it's professional killers. It's an ex-army guy. There's an ex-navy guy involved, and then some other uh, probably people who are involved in the military uh, that he's in, invited into his little group to uh, satanic ri satanically ritually rape me and murder me. Um, and it's sad because they are professional killers. They've been trained by our country to to murder people, uh, to fight wars, and they're using this against. Uh, women with children, uh, me, I'm just this middle-aged guy, like a citizen who hasn't done anything. Um, but they are, they're using trained killing methods and discipline that they've learned in, in uh, military branches. Uh, and I'm not saying all military is bad, and I never will, uh, but some of them are going along, and they're killing citizens, and they're using what the government has trained them to do to kill people, on U.S. citizens. This is a huge deal. Uh, please, if you're somebody who's not targeted, do not pass up these videos and say, you know, those people are crazy. This is technology that's like over the horizon radar and satellite directed energy weapons, the DOD, the Air Force, many branches of, of the armed uh, military are involved in this, um, experimenting on our own people and, and murdering us. Uh, trying to silence us if we do, you know, get out too much information. I'm sorry if I've, like, I don't want to come off as, you know, scaring people, but I do want to just tell my situation how I perceive it. Um, it is, it's, it's pretty, uh, I guess the word for it is, right now I'm feeling very uh, survivalistic. I'm feeling like I've got to get defenses up. I can't really enjoy my life because... You know, I'm being tortured, and I know a lot of y'all are in the same situation right now. Um, you know, I'm I'm just gonna go ahead and end this because uh, it's because I want to get it in two parts. Um, but I will I'll make another video at the end of the night. Um, you know, maybe a prayer, and then put that out. Uh, I hope you guys are doing all right. God bless you. Um, and I kind of just want to wanted to make a video to vent, um, to show y'all what I've been doing. The, the copper uh, mesh does work, but it's it's not working great. Um, so I'm going to work out some other things and try and work on some other things. Um, I hope you all are doing all right. Please, if you if you need help or you want to talk, please email me at vulcanwolverine at gmail.com. Um, you know, all right, guys. God bless you all. Um, and I just I hope your fight's going good. Um, we got to start getting together, getting on these conference calls. Uh, you know, we have to do this. There is no choice. Um, this is coming to our future. Um, this technology and the wrong people have it. I don't know how that happened. It was done on purpose. Um, so I have, I have no idea who planned that, but they hate humans. 
Um, they hate America. They hate the world.